and Akila here. Hi everyone, I am Akila and I am seven years old. Today we are going to do a still life using oil pasta. That's right, are you excited? Yeah. <laughs> Let's get started. So for this session, we'll need our oil pastels, eraser, pencil, and a sheet of tape. So the first thing we're going to draw is a job. So I'm going to put my points right about here. And then I'm going to go all the way up. I'm going to go up, 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 up. I'm going to go around. And then I'm going to go up like that. Good job. And then we're going to draw the top of our jar. We're going to go around. Like that. We're going to go around. And then we're going to come down. So whatever we do on one side, we're going to do on the other side, okay? Okay. We're going to come around. Like that. And then I'm going to come down. Good. And now we're going to start to draw an apple. I'm going to start from here and then I'm going to go all the way around. We're going to go around. And we're going to stop right here. And now we're going to draw the stem of our apple. So right about here, I'm going to make a little line like that. So this will be the top of our apple. Right. And then I'm going to come out. I'm going to go up, make a curve there. Then make another curve there for our stem. Nice. And now we're going to draw some grapes. So here I'm going to draw some circles and some ovals. And some curves. I'm just going to come down more with like this. And now we're going to draw an orange. I'm going to go all the way up and then I'm going to come around. I'm just going to go right under the grip. Now, we're going to draw a stem for our orange. So here, I'm going to put my points here and then I'm going to go all the way up, come across, and then I'm going to come down. Good job. And now I'm going to draw a leaf. So right about here, I'm going to come out with a point and then I'm going to go back in like that. Now let's draw those lines in the middle of our leaf. I'm going to come out like that. And then I'm going to draw a line here. Another line here, another line here, and another line there. Now let's finish our jar. I'm going to continue drawing the rim of my jar. I'm going to go around like that. So now let's put our objects on a table. So right about here, I'm going to go across. I'm going to make a straight line. And then I'm going to put another straight line here. And now we're going to erase this line here that we made before. 
that is crossing over our apple. Now we're all done with our drawing. Let's use our pastels now. With our jar, we are going to use blue. I'm going to use dark blue and red. So we're going to start off with our lighter blue. And we're going to color on this side. So now we're going to use our darker blue so that we'll have shadows on this side of our job. Let's blend our dark blue and light blue together. Okay, let's blend them. Using our fingers. So now we're going to use a mixture of black and dark blue for the inside of our jar. So let's add some black. Not too much because that black is really strong. And over that, I'm going to add my dark blue. And then we're going to blend them together. Now let's color our apple. We are going to use red, orange, and yellow. So we're going to start off with our red on this side of our apple. And now we're going to add some yellow on this area of our apple. And that yellow and blend out into our red. Now we're going to use the colors of our grape. We're going to use dark green and we're going to use light. So we're going to start off with our lighter green. We're going to color all our grapes in the middle there. I'm going to leave some spaces on the ends of our darker green. And now we're going to add our darker green on the outside of our grapes. And then we're going to blend. Now we're going to use orange and yellow for our orange. Closer to our jar, we're going to add our Now we're going to add our yellow. We're going to blend our yellow into our orange. Now let's color our leaves using dark green and light green. So we're going to start off with our lighter green first. And then we're going to draw the veins on our leaves with our dark green. We're also going to color that stem with our darker green. Let's add some yellow on the tips of our leaves here. Also, Let's use brown to color the stem on our apple. And let's put this little detail here on our apple. It's a little curve there. Now we are going to add all, all our remaining light and shadow. Let's start off by adding our shadows. Right, so I'm going to use black here. 
and then I'm going to color in all our object shadows. And then after, you can use your fingers to blend that out. But just remember, when you're using black, it's a really strong color. So don't add too much. Let's add some shadows on the, the rim of our jar here. Right, so let's add some white here for highlights. Let's add a highlight on the left side of our orange. And also a highlight on the left side of our apple. Also, let's add some highlights on our grapes, on the left side of our circles and ovals. Let's blend the highlights on our picture. Let's use two different shades of brown from the table. Let's start off. So we're starting off with our lighter brown. Now we're going to do the background. I am going to do two shades of pink. And I am going to use two different shades of purple. Let's start off with our black under our fruits and then we're going to blend that black into our darker brown. So here we have it guys, I was still like using oil pasta. Did you enjoy this piece? Yeah. So if you enjoyed this video, feel free to like, share and subscribe. See you guys in the next video. Bye! Bye.